You got it. I got it. I got it. Yeah. Watch it. <laughs> He's like, I'm just getting started. Only rapped a few songs. <laughs> He's like, nah, I'm not paying this. What's up guys, John Anthony here from John Anthony Lifestyle. In today's video, we're gonna be looking at rappers losing their cool in a steamy encounter, okay, otherwise known as dates, and I will be breaking down their probably shitty game, okay, to show you guys that fucking having a whole bunch of status won't magically teach you how to run an interaction properly or how to have good verbals, okay? So before we jump into that, I want you guys to be aware we have a case study challenge, okay? We're taking on a group of small, a small group of people, about eight people to go through the eight week program and serve as end-to-end -end case studies, okay? They'll get the old pricing before the pricing went up on June 1st by $1,800. They'll get extra attention from me and they will get a chance to win a free boot camp. Okay, the details for that eight week challenge are in the description. Just click the link, go to the webpage, listen to the audio that I put together. If it sounds like something you're interested in, then you can apply and I will be reviewing all the applications personally. So let's jump into rappers losing their cool in a steamy encounter. Okay, here we go. <laughs> this dude's like smoking weed while he's going on the date here. <laughs> None of them are even saying hello, they're all like. <laughs> <Hi>. <laughs> <laughs> How many fucking rappers are there? They all have face tats. What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> What's happening? Hi, my name is Julia. How are you today? I'm a relationship expert. Right. <laughs> Seems awkward as fuck. My name's Lee Chang Chang. I'm a relationship expert. Nice Hi. to meet Bye -bye. you. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Wi-Fi. So are you single? <laughs> What's your name? Wi-Fi. Oh, okay, Wi-Fi. Do you have the Wi-Fi password? Dollar bill. Yes. That's nice. <laughs> Are you? Yes. That's fine. Yeah. Just because, like, no girls caught my attention yet. I feel like... He's like, no girls caught my attention yet, so I suck dick on the side. That love tattooed on his face. Not even dating. I feel like it takes a lot for me to invest myself into a girl. And this is the Wi-Fi needs to just be by himself and just focus on. <laughs> Mr. Wi-Fi just needs to be by himself, plugged into the cable modem. His career and make <laughs> all the money in the world. Do you have a girlfriend? Huh? Do you have a girlfriend? Every single. <laughs> this dude looks like 19. Austin Summers, distant cousin. Yeah. Oh no. You're not single. Something like that. <laughs> Guys can't even keep their composure. He's like, ah, what do I say? What do I do? <clears throat> You're not sure about it. <laughs> yeah, I'm single. You're single? Yeah. So do you masturbate? <laughs> yeah. yeah, a lot. Yeah. I keep my face off. Any crazy <laughs> stories? Damn. Sounds like you do. I don't. <laughs> do any crazy stories? Damn, I don't. Damn, I don't. <laughs> That's not what you should say. You don't. I don't believe it. I don't got no interesting stories at the studio. 
He ain't got no interesting stories. That's what you're supposed to. That's when you're supposed to fucking demonstrate higher value. Okay, you should have like basically outlines and frameworks of stories where you can demonstrate a whole bunch of cool shit about yourself without bragging. Oh. I'm not some BJ addict, but there's a studio in Los Angeles that I know for sure. Everywhere where I could have one, I got one. <laughs> He's like at the trap house on the street. Yeah, fucking incredible. One of my shining moments, man. <laughs> this girl's like, well, great, tell me more. You know? uh, no, I actually haven't had any, any stories in the studio yet. That's something I haven't experienced in life yet, honestly. You guys sound boring as fuck. Hey, what's some cool experience you had? Uh, I've had zero. Oh, what girls are you dating? Oh, I don't date, I just rap. Can you be honest with me? Thanks. I by the way, these guys all look like fucking hard case noobs, <laughs> even though they're rappers and maybe, you know, getting some attention from their fame. Okay, they don't even know how to interact at a basic level. Okay. Do you remember the last time? Facts. Fresh prints over there. I'm going to head a whiskey dick. <laughs> what is a whiskey dick? You don't know. Well, it's when you're too drunk and you can get hurt. Did you ever had it? That's crazy because I, I, honestly, I don't drink. You don't drink? I don't drink at all. He's like, I don't drink, I don't fuck, I have zero cool experiences, but I do have a love tattooed on my face. Wow. Every girl could get every inch of this bony love in you, D. Did female inspire you? Real women inspire me like. Let's have uh, a little follow up sequel here where they all take an IQ test. Like strong women like my mother <laughs> and you know, my Angelo and shit like that. But uh, as far as chicken heads, I'm on my pivot. <laughs> all right, I'm not even gonna touch that one. What is your type? <laughs> Skinny, yeah. brunette, Russian. Any fetishes? I like big girls, you know? You said what? I'm gonna come clean. I like my belly rub. <laughs> nah, I mean. Uh, I don't know. Nah, I'm cool. I'm cool. cool. I don't. I, uh, like, if you want my attention, just show me a fat ass quick. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, in a pretty face to match with it. And I'm <laughs> what do you like? Show me a fat ass quick. God, fetishes. Yeah, like sexual. I like it. So, what do you like to do is uh, if you take a girl on a date? I don't really take no. Damn, I'm trying to figure out. He's like, I've never been on a date. I'm only 19, just like Austin Summers. I take a girl bowling or something. Yeah. <laughs> take a girl bowling. I feel like I get like more news than like anything. Hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. All type of girls. It's like news are like seasons. Like there'll be like a certain month that it's just like. Oh, he's got hate tattooed on the other side. You just get nudes and then there'll be like a good three months where I'm not getting nudes. What, what season is it usually? See, the season right now, this is the nobody likes Wi-Fi season. Who does send me, fellas? Everybody's using a wired internet. Nobody likes Wi-Fi. Nah. <laughs> no? No, you can send me phones though, you know what I'm saying? Hell yeah. Yeah? Yeah. How good are you with your tongue? My tongue? Yes. Oh, wow, you nasty. So you into Dragon Ball? Oh, you into Dragon Balls? I got something for you. A little bit. I so, go cool like Vegeta. <laughs> These guys are smooth as butter. Uh, by the way, are you paying for this? Oh yeah, I'll pay for it. Yeah. My okay. shit. <laughs> He's wearing like a mask half off his face. Uh, are you paying for this? Yeah, of course. You know when you're around me? No worries. Pulls out a big stack of bills. <laughs> oh, definitely. You know, I got okay. this. Come okay. on. Thank you. Come on. It was nice talking to you. You're amazing. So, thank you for your time. And, um, are you paying for this? Yeah, I got it. Don't even trust. Don't thank you. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> is that the bill? Like, how much it is? Or is that the number they're going to call for us to go pick up our food? This ain't even no Cabernet. <laughs> Wow. Hey, bro, bro, tell me something. It's a good wine. What's it called? Don't worry, I got it. You got it? I got it. Oh, shit, the best. Damn, I'm gonna put y'all get y'all up. Hey, hey, never mind, she got it. Huh? Are you paying for this? How much it cost? No. No? no. What kind of 
You're not paying? The way my life's set up right now. Okay. <laughs> He's like, I'm just getting started. Only rapped a few songs. <laughs> He's like, nah, I'm not paying this. No. This is what guys do in the community. They're like, okay, can't be a provider, can't be a simp, can't be a beta. Uh, can you pay for this? And the girl's like, go fuck yourself, bro. Okay. You got I it. Got it. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Yeah. Watch it. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck was that, cuz? What the fuck was that, cuz? Everybody did not feel like myself. My nigga felt like I got high out of nowhere. Yeah, super dumb. Goes to show you, okay, status isn't gonna fucking solve your problems. Okay, getting strong in the gym isn't gonna solve your problems. Getting rich in business is not gonna solve your problems. You need strategy and tactics. You need fucking game, okay? We're running this case study challenge, selecting eight guys. You can fill in an application with the link in the description. You'll get extra attention from me. You'll get the old pricing, and you will also get a chance to win a free live bootcamp valued at close to $7,000. Go look at the page, go listen to the audio, see if it's something you're interested in. I'll be reviewing all the applications firsthand. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please email me at john at johnanthonylifestyle.com if you have other videos for me to react to or infields for me to break down. Please subscribe, let me know what you think in the comments. Take two seconds, press the like button. Always appreciate that. Thank you guys so much. More infield breakdowns of my own coming soon and lots of good stuff. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys in the next video. Also check out my TikTok. Okay, I have the link in the description for my TikTok. Get on that, like and follow, etc. if you have not yet, okay? Thank you guys, talk soon. Take a look at the scores. I put numbers up on the boards. I'm in a section with models, and you're at the bar trying to get out a cluster of fours. Fixed trauma factor, I'm a boss tycoon. My dick smells like two chicks before noon.